At Starbucks, our approach to ethically sourcing coffee is called CAFE Practices, which stands for Coffee and Farmer Equity. CAFE Practices serves as a guide for farmers to grow coffee in a way that is good for both people and planet. These buying guidelines have four components, all necessary to achieve sustainability, quality, economic transparency, social responsibility, and environmental leadership. But what do these four components really mean? What do they look like in action? I'm Julie Anderson, Senior Manager of Global Coffee Sustainability, and we're going to explore what CAFE practices means on farms and in our tasting rooms. Quality is taste in cup, meaning in order for a coffee to be purchased, it needs to meet our high standards and specific quality requirements. We look at the green, unroasted beans for defects and we taste, or cup, coffee in our tasting rooms to ensure quality. We taste over 250,000 cups each year. Lower quality coffees won't demand as high of a price which doesn't contribute to a sustainable future for coffee farming. Starting in 1998, Starbucks changed the industry by implementing thorough economic transparency. Farmers, producers, exporters are all required to submit evidence of payments or receipts made for green coffee throughout the supply chain, including how much was paid directly to farmers. If transparency does not exist, it's very difficult to maintain strong relationships throughout the supply chain, which is critical for sustainability. Social responsibility is all about people. Coffee producers need to protect the rights of people working on their farms and must have measures in place that promote a safe and fair work environment. Social responsibility also includes investing in things like worker housing, wells for water, access to education, and medical care, and that workers must be paid at least the minimum legal wage on a regular basis. When the rights and well-being of workers and their families are protected, benefits ripple through the coffee community and across the supply chain. And we move toward a better future for the people who grow our coffee and for coffee itself. Environmental leadership is about caring for the land. With growing and processing coffee, environmental measures must be in place to preserve biodiversity and conserve and protect water. These measures like protecting water bodies on farms and planting shade trees and plants to prevent soil erosion during heavy rains help farmers to adapt to impacts of climate change. When coffee producers take steps to protect the ecosystems they live in, they ensure that the land will be healthy enough to support farming and the livelihoods of everyone involved for years to come. At Starbucks, we ethically source coffee in ways that meet the needs of the present without compromising the ability of future generations to meet their own needs. We are committed to ethically sourcing 100% of our coffee in partnership with Conservation International and believe all four components of CAFE practices are necessary for coffee to be truly sustainable. And all of this helps farmers grow coffee in a way that's better for both people and the planet. Together, We've changed the way coffee is grown to be more sustainable, better for the environment, and resilient for the future. <laughs>